Right, today we're going to discuss the Discovery Trayback kit uh, that we sell at the Fiat 4 x um, A lot of people seem to be able to put it together pretty well, uh, but we do have some questions. So I thought I'd just have a bit of a go through of what you'll need, what you'll get, and the easiest way really of building one. Um, so basically we'll start off with some of the parts or some of the tools that you'll need for the job. Grinder. So one with a cut off and a flat disc. Uh, this is how we make most of our tube notches. Um, we have got a linisher as well but we don't use it that often. Most of it's all done by using a grinder. Uh, spirit level. If it ain't level, then it's never going to fit together properly. Um, cheap, cheerful, doesn't matter, as long as the bubble's in the middle. Plumb bob. We use these for uh, setting up the X in the middle. A sharpie or paint stick, anything to mark the tube for your notches. Uh, goggles, tape measure, right angle, and important, some clamps. Um, basically, when you tack it all together, just clamp as much as you can. Try and keep it nice, straight, and square. Um, you'll get right, a load of tube. Let me go. Sorry. So this, we've uh, knocked up a old disco to put one of our cages on. Right. So we'll start from the back, which is the easiest. Easiest part to start with. Start with this hoop and mount it onto the chassis. Uh, just tack weld it, get it all nice, straight and level and then that's your base to work from then. So after you've put that in, put the first bar in for the X. Leave the second one out, but just put the first one in, it'll keep everything a bit more solid. Next, get the stays in. Pop the stays in. They need to be kind of up into the corners as far as possible. And then down onto the chassis. Then after that, put the center, uh, the rest of the X in. Um, then we put the tray on. Tray is a bit tight, bit fiddly. Um, it's a lot easier if you've got a couple of people to help you out. Uh, then you can go ahead and wow, start tack welding. As I said before, just tack it together. There's no point going uh, mad with the welder just yet, because if you have done something that's not quite right, then uh, you can just cut off a couple of tabs and jobs are good. And, uh, then from there, we start going forward. So we put the front hoop on. So we put that in place, get that level squared up, and then we fit then the roof bars. The top X, we'll put the one in and then leave the next the uh, rest of it until you've uh, taken the cage off. Just makes it easier. You can do it on. But the cage has got to come off really to uh, final weld everything. So we've got the hoop on, then the front wings. Again, they are tight, so they've got to be stretched out slightly so that you can get them to fit. and then the headlight panels. And that is the basic of one of our uh, kits. Um, 
I'll do it. We'll put some photos in as I've done as I've gone along. Uh, just to help anybody else out. Um, but if anybody's got any questions regarding any of our kits, um, just drop us a message.